going. Cool. Thought I'd get back into this uh, classic horror series that I was doing on YouTube a while back. Obviously, I don't do the videos anymore. But, when I got time, and I got time now. So, what the fuck, eh? I'll do it. I'll do a video from my fucking iPhone. First time doing this. But, uh, so yeah, classic horror series. I, I remember I did this and it was supposed to go up to 10 like I did for the other series, like the random horror series. Uh, did like two or three of these different series that I would go up to 10 and I... And I went and looked back and I, I said, oh shit, I only did five of the classic horror series and shit, I was thinking of doing a video, just talking about horror movies, something I haven't done in a long fucking time. Just, you know, we buy them all, we do this shit, but we don't really get to talk to them, about them too much. Well, I don't, because there's no one around, like, uh, uh, only online I get to talk to people but not actually like talking like we're we're yeah i guess we do we some of us do but like you know you know what i'm saying for me anyway where i am but so for the classic horror series uh number six i'm gonna do this bad boy uh carnival of souls don't know if you've seen that in reverse that's weird oh because maybe I flipped the camera around all right yeah sorry a bit of editing there I was looking at the it's it's fine it's fine I'm just fucked it's I'm seeing it that way but the recording comes out fine so yeah so it was uh, carnival of souls um, there you go. So classic horror number series uh classic horror series number sixer, Carnival of Souls. That is Criterion. The Criterion collection. These are fucking expensive, man. Uh I think I got this on a special though from their that website. Uh the fuck it's like a bookstore type of deal. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, you know what? I'm rambling here. What's new? So, fucking gonna crack this open. Actually, I'm chugging this right here. Start off Saturday night. Cheers. Let's do it. I'm thirsty. <sighs> Yeah, little bit of fucking moose head for ya. Boom. Let's crack this other fucking bitch open and pour it in the glass here. I needed that. Holy shit, did I need that? All right, all right, get her in there, bitch. Foamy bitch. Look at that foamy bitch. Foamy bitch. You foamy bitch. Fucks it up in another. Um, back to the bad boy. Uh, so the Criterion Collection. That's fucking sweet, the back there. I like that fucking symbol. Carnival of Souls. Um, that is a great edition. 19, it's so made in 1962. Um, 78 minutes long. That's a, that's a short movie, eh? Um, so, is fucking anyone home? What's happening here? Fucking chaos.
uh, black and white, of course. Uh, directed by Her Carvey. Uh, doesn't have her name on the back. What's her name? Candice. Candice. Silagloss? Silagloss? That, that played Mary. Her Carvey, who directed it, it's also. That's Mary, by the way. The star, of course. One of the greatest fucking movies ever made. Inspired. George Romero said this inspired Night of the Living Dead. Big inspiration, and you could see it too. Trust me. Uh, back to Herc Harvey. He um, directed, but he was also the, the creepy fucking... The creepy guy, man. The, you know what? There's the inside. Kind of a salsa. Everybody came with a poster! <coughs> Motherfuckers! It came with a poster! Look at that. That's him. Right there. I think that's him. If I, uh, if I remember correctly, he's also the director, but he's the creepy fucking... The creepy dude. That's a pretty fucking good cool poster. Let's back it up there. Beep! Beep! Wait, there you go. Yeah, okay, you can see it. Okay, there's a bunch of shit on the back here. Candace Healy Gloss. What did I say? Silly Gloss? Healy Goss. That's the name of Mary. That's her name. And this is an awesome, awesome fucking transfer to. This is Blu ray, by the way. Uh, Criterion Collection. Yeah, Blu-ray. And, uh, basically, Carnival of Souls is one big fucking mind trip. I don't know why I'm randomly humping the air here. And, uh, <coughs> just the masterpiece. I don't know what else to say. I said quite a bit, and uh, look at the time of the video here. It's gonna be a long one because I'm fucking shit faced now. Actually, no, I'm not shit faced. That was my first beer, the one I just chugged. I'm about to go fucking barbecue some steak. And uh, what else do I have to say here? This is one of those movies that got me into horror. Not the first. It helped along the way. Uh, because back, you know, when you're a fucking kid and you're watching horror movies like us, horror movie fucking nut barns, we just straight to the horror section. No one knows that nowadays. It's only from my generation because... The video stores are gone. And you know that one when you walk into the video store. Boom! Straight to the horror section. I remember that. Every fucking video store. And, uh... No, but Carnival of Souls is good. Night of the Living Dead was the one that got me into horror movies, like, back then. But... This was, this was along the way, and I just remember that fucker freaking me out. Uh, the main guy there. And, uh... I'm trying to think... I know there's more to say, cause because I'm trying to think, how do you explain Carnival of Souls? That's what's going through my brain right now. That's why I'm stalling. I'm just trying to say random shit to try and... Uh, remember, how do you explain Carnival of Souls? I don't know if you can. You have to watch it. It's like one big fucking mind trip and then, you know, oh, it just keeps going. I think I've shown this on my my cast, my cast of Bond, um, the movie one. Uh, so, it's just... Uh, 
it's, it seems like the main star, Mary, is dreaming. When you're watching the movie, it seems like she's dreaming a lot of the stuff in the movie. When she goes on the mind trip type of things where... Uh, You, okay, it's, I'm not really good at explaining movies. I'm good at, I'm kind of good at uh, talking about them, like, like general stuff, like this and that, oh, this guy, but, but explaining more of a beastly, especially one like this, that you have to, have to fucking see if you haven't seen it. Go see, if you have not seen this, first of all, are you a horror fan? If you have not seen this, are you really... Really, I need a sip for that. And I'm done. That's it. I'm going to barbecue some fucking steak because I'm hungry. Look at the size of me. I need a fucking steak. And here we go. Retardation sits in. That's the fucking. That's it. Classic horror series number six. Carnival of Souls. Haven't seen it. Get your fucking ass in gear and watch this bitch. This fucking beautiful fucking horror movie that's amazing in every way. There you go. Peace out. Rocket Nader.